The find function finds the elements of a logical array that are true. For example, if we had an array of scores here that contains four different scores, we can ask the question, which of these scores is greater than 80? If we say some array scores is greater than 80, it will check if that statement is true element by element. So is 78 greater than 80? False or 0. Is 98 greater than 80? True. 1. Is 100 greater than 80? True. Is 67 greater than 80? False. So this right hand side here is a logical array 0, 1, 1, 0 and that gets stored in A. So A becomes a logical array. We can put this logical array into the find function and what find will do is say which of these elements of A is true. 2 and 3 are returned by the function, two values. We can simplify the previous set of commands by directly saying find scores greater than 80 and storing that in B. As before, two values, 2 and 3 in this case, will be stored in B. So B becomes a 1 by 2 array with two values, 2 and 3. If you want to then find the actual values of the actual scores that were greater than 80, we can put in this array B uh, in between the parentheses in, uh, when we say scores uh, parentheses B. And what this will do is give us the second and third elements of the scores array. So we can say scores <clears throat> we'll say that equals six different values and then we can ask the question scores greater than let's say three which elements have scores that are greater than 3. The first 3, 4, 7, and 9 are greater than 3. The last 3, 2, 1, 3 are not. So if we say find scores greater than 3, this will tell us the first, second, and third elements of this array scores is greater than 3. If we store these values in an array, let's call it C, we have the values 1, 2, and 3 stored in the array C. So we can say scores of C, and that will return to us the values stored in the first, second, and third uh, elements of scores.